morning students now we are going to do the problems of exercise 1.4 in the exercise 1.4 we are going to do the first problem what is given here visualize 3.765 on the number line using successive magnification so we have to locate the given real number on the number line by using the successive magnification what is the meaning of your successive magnification nothing confusion here successive magnification is nothing but whatever the real number is given up to two decimal places or three decimal places or six decimal places whatever the number of decimal places here doesn't matter first we are coming to the whole number okay suppose there is a number 3.5 how can you locate 3.5 on the number line first we are choosing okay the 3.5 where does it lie i mean the 3.5 lies between 3 and 4 so we consider the whole numbers first of all so in in between whole numbers we have that given real number example i said 3.5 3.5 lies between the whole numbers 3 and 4 then we are taking 3 4 on the number line and uh, between 3 and 4 we are making 10 equal portions i mean that 3.1 3.2 3.3 3.4 3.5 3.6 3.7 3.8 3.9 and 4 like that we are making 10 equal parts whatever you take suppose i have taken two whole numbers 3 and 4 what i say that between 3 and 4 we are making 10 equal parts okay then we are going to find 3.5 between them in such a way here what i am doing is 3.765 we have three decimal places here after point we have three digits that is our three decimal places 3.765 can be visualized here like whatever the steps i have drawn and taken here just to have a look first you have to observe that 3.765 3.765 lies between the whole numbers 3 and 4 yes or not that is why i am taking here the whole numbers 3 4 on the number line the starting number i have taken as 3 and ending number i have taken as 4 and between them i have taken 10 equal parts see this is one part 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 that is how we need to mark those okay portions like 3.1 3.2 3.3 3.4 3.5 3.6 3.7 3.9 and 4 is it clear in this again come to the point we need 3.765 no? so then 3.76 you check this 3.765 this whole thing between 3.7 and 3.8 is it or not because 3.765 i said that lies between 3.7 and 3.8 now you take extremes i mean end numbers as 3.7 and 3.8 on the number line in the next step that is why okay we can draw a number line and take the starting number 3.7 next 3.8 so the 3.7 between 3.7 and 3.8 again you make 10 equal portions okay that is i am writing here see okay 3.71 3.72 3.73 3.74 3.75 and 
check 10 portions will be ok we need 3.765 now again 3.76 ok where it will be that is between ok that is between 3.76 and 3.77 because between 3.76 and 3.77 we are making 10 equal portions like one, like 3.761 76 is common 761 762 763 like that come to the next step here 3.76 and 3.77 are the extremes on the number line I mean starting number and the ending number 3.76 is starting number in the next drawing ok and 3.77 is ending number that is why I have taken 3.76 ok starting number and 3.7 ok 3.77 is ending number so that is why here what I am telling is between 3.76 and 3.77 make 10 equal parts again 3.761 762, 763, 764, 765, 766, 767, 768, 769, then 3.77, 0. 69 means next to 70 will come now. 3.770, no need to write 0, 3.77. In this now check out, where is 3.765 which we need? That is ERC. 3.765. This is the okay location of 3.765 on the number line. This we are finding by the successive magnification on the number.